AITA for ending my relationship after my girlfriend said no to marriage, I, 41M, had been dating my ex-girlfriend, 39F, for nearly 6 years. Our relationship was strong. For years ago, I informed her family and friends that I planned to propose to her while we were on a family vacation and received their blessing. On the night I proposed, I tried to make it as memorable and as perfect as possible. I asked her after a lovely dinner, surrounded by family, and she said, no, not yet, anyway. Honestly, I was quite hurt and went back to our room to think things through without reacting impulsively. A few hours later, she came to the room and asked me why I left and what was wrong. We had a long conversation about my feelings and her reasons for turning down the proposal. It turned out she didn't think I was ready for that level of commitment yet. I took her thoughts seriously and let her know I understood, but I was raised to believe that a no is a no, not a, a maybe next time. She asked me to wait a little longer until we were in a more stable situation, and I agreed. 8 to 10 months later, she started dropping hints that she was ready for marriage. I can't wait for our wedding. Our wedding is going to be spectacular. I'm so looking forward to my dad walking me down the aisle, and so on. A little over a year after my first proposal, I decided to try again. This time, it was just the two of us on a wonderful date night. When I opened the ring box, she became very quiet and once again said, no, not yet, maybe later. After this second rejection, I stopped feeling the same way about her. It sounds cold, but it's the truth. When we returned home, I slept in the guest bedroom and spent the night reflecting on our relationship. The next morning, she asked why I didn't sleep in our bedroom, and I told her the truth. I explained that I thought it was time to end the relationship. I let her know that I take marriage very seriously, and I didn't want to be strung along any longer. For me, this no was the final one. I gave her a month to find a new place to live, but since then, I've been receiving texts and emails from her friends and family, calling me heartless and telling me to give her more time, calling me insensitive for ending things. My friends, however, have been supportive and understand why I made the decision. Ita